Swords and Dreams Reptile Rescue. You can see the captive bred baby boa sitting in the back of this cage here, working its way up. Um, anyway, this uh, beautiful bow is getting ready to eat this mouse. This will be his first meal. And if you look at the pattern on these guys, they got a very beautiful pattern. Um, I should have showed you all of them feeding, but we will be having these up for sale. We're going to ask $100 a piece. They actually came from a captive breeder in our area. They're really nice. They're like silver in color, and I think they're worth more than what we're asking. Um, and the more I look at them, I'm thinking I may even keep them just for bloodlines because they're just phenomenal. You can just see, like, in the pattern in the back, how it links together. It has that trait like a Nicaraguan boa because, hey, you know how, like, the saddles all, like, attach together? Give it that chain look. Bang! Did you see that? That was awesome. Anyway, I'm going to zoom in close. The saddles there, that's just phenomenal coloration. And while I got one out here, I just want to show you one of my albino boas. Some of us are leaning towards this albino boa being a... Uh, uh, glow. Oh, by kind of hard to see its tail, but you can see it's just a phenomenal looking snake. So we got some good looking boas coming here at Swords and Dreams, and soon to have a lot more. That you can find. God bless and thanks for your support.